Alright, alright, this is pick 12. Now, pick 12 was a trade. It was a trade. The Chargers got this from me. I'll leave my hand. He bought the save, so fuck. those spots into the 12th spot to pick Earl Thomas. Let's see who the commissioner is going to announce right now. The Miami Dolphins have traded the number 12 pick to San Diego. With the 12th pick in the 2010 NFL Draft, the San Diego Chargers select Ryan Matthews, running back, Fresno State. Now, this dude is barely bigger than Sproles, right? No, bigger. He's, he's, he's six foot tall, foot tall six feet, yeah. 218. <laughs> there you go, ahead. Man, I'm telling you, man, they got it all wrong. They, you knew he was getting the ball, and everybody keyed on him. He's still playing. Remember Fresno State? Well, played. see, this is this is crazy. They said one of the things the problem with him. He needs to stay healthy. That's because the he, problem with they the ran him in the ground. But that's the problem. He, he played against the Illinois. Illinois. Remember, Fresno oh, wow. State was we take all comers, anybody. He ran and man, he got the ball so many times. It was ridiculous when he played Illinois. Every team he played, he got the when he played Cincinnati. If he can't stay healthy, he was the bad pick. He was Chargers. rushing for 30 rushes a game. He's a bad pick. Chargers don't use a fullback no more, am I right? No. no. So this is not a good pick for them if they Bro, don't use when a you fullback see this no man more. in this in the season, y'all I'm telling you. They just said he needs to stay healthy. And look how many picks they gave up to get to that. They get uh, they gave up a second round pick number 40 and a fourth round pick. Damn. And they switched picks and they went to the 20. And who the hell is Tim Dobbins? Ain't he an actor? No, he's our linebacker. <laughs> and they said Tim Robbins. No, that's Tim Robbins. Yeah. Oh, Those Robbins or Dobbins? Dobbins. 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 Robbins. Tim Dobbins came from, uh, came from Miami. Well, yeah. we already got a, Dob a linebacker. Uh, well, now y'all got oh, two of them. Uh, fuck it. They used to call me Crazy Joe, but now you call me. I, I like the pick. I, <laughs> I, I, I call it. I just didn't call it that you guys would move up. Who did Miami game. receive? I didn't I did get the They received the. Uh, they switched picks with they you got, guys. They got, one. Joe, they got Joe. They got. Uh, your number two and four. They got your two, four, and something else. And they, they got, switched. Uh, they, they went down to number picks. 28. I can tell you right now the reason why that pick, that trade happened, they didn't want to run the risk of not being able to get Ryan Matthews. It could, exactly. Skinner was their number one. He was gone. gone. They hoped it would have fell down. They panicked, public. dog. Once yeah, Skinner so they had to move up to get the next one on the depth chart. And so. as you can see in this draft, a lot of teams panic because when one team makes a move and they go out of character, everybody goes out of character. Because I don't think this cat was the cat y'all needed if y'all was looking for a running back. I really don't. It, it was, I'm not mad at it because you got to get what's available and how it graded out. I'm sure Spiller was yeah, the top was back to get. Ball. After yeah. that, Ryan Matthews yeah. might have graded now, with now them in the top what's three. What's Matthews' size like? That's the kid from San Diego State, right? No, no Fresno State. State. 5'11", 5'11", 218. 218. So that, and that's the kid they got, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah they panicked. They panicked. Yeah. Because I think he still would I'm telling you, that's a damn They gave up pick. three picks. I'm not, I'm not mad at the pick. You got to get what's available. And if you got the top three backs, the first one was taken, which was Spiller. Matthews might have been. He was two. He was okay. If he was two, they had to trade yeah, up to get him. Charlie Best was three. Then you had Toby Gerhardt at four. Y'all could have rolled with Toby Gerhardt. I like Gerhardt myself. I'm not going to even lie he to you. He's more of a bruise. And hey, Toby, I like Gerhardt. And bro, on a real, I agree with you. To go with y'all offense and all the passing y'all doing, that would have been perfect. perfect. Short, they just mad because you perfect. ain't got the compression run, for the connection. Run the white boy. Bring back Van yeah. Egan and and Zonka and Ryan. Right, you want to talk about somebody that was why over you? White boy. Because he is white. Gerhardt from out here. Toby. God damn it. <laughs> hey, I'm going to tell you about Gerhardt. Gerhardt uh, uh, carried the rock a lot at Stafford. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Just like Ryan Matthews. The and they knew Gerhardt was going to get the ball, and he got injured a couple of times. Ryan Matthews, I'm telling you, is and a damn good your words at the end of your sentence? You don't, you don't hear that. You don't hear that, does it? Anyway. <laughs> Here's where we had another trade. Hey, they is they. The number 13 pick I'm to already up. in the world of shit. With the 13th pick in the 2010 NFL Draft, the Philadelphia Eagles select Brandon Graham, defensive end, Michigan. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And, and I'm another kid, he played 3 4. No, they played 3 4 or 4 3. 4 3, but he could. They, he, he can't really stand up, but they're trying to make him like a Dwight Freeney. I mentioned this the other day in our conversation. He is a. Prototype just like Dwight Freeney. He moves, he is active. The thing is, is everybody kept harping on his arm length. Oh, his arms are too short. Oh, if the tackle reaches out, he can't get by. Get the fuck out of here. 
Watch this, people. Watch this talent right here. Well, in this practice. is another practice. Yeah, thing, in man. practice. And no, watch, practice. wait till you see the games. He went against Brian Beluga, the uh, tackle from uh, Iowa, and he went against uh, a few other cats. Man, this guy is good. Big Ten is smoking mirrors, man. Oh, oh yo, we'll understand. see. We'll yeah. see Pac-10. Big Ten is smoking mirrors. Pac-10 is smoking mirrors. All right, well, here's his actual game tape right here. His game footage. Wasn't nobody over him. Wasn't no, nobody over him. And the guy just let him go. Yeah, he had a free. And that's an all-star game anyway. Okay, keep watching. Nobody over him on an all-star game, man. Come on, man. One-on-one, -on -one, boom. Yeah. That's a running back with a defensive end. Huh? Well, look, I say this. So what, they going to try and do the same thing Andy does? Put him out there way, way, way wide. Way out there, splitting wide splits. And then just tell him. Uh, I'll run because I'll run you the went, cause, because when edge. you bring that tackle around, I can bring another back inside in a three four, and boom, we got it. So pretty but much, I, pretty much, they're gonna use him as bait so they can blitz. All right, yeah. yeah. Hey man, y'all subscribe, man. I, I want y'all to subscribe. You Don't be the down one down. left out when you get, see all the stuff that we are gonna have for you upcoming. You are gonna be like, okay, the ones that's on it gonna be on it. The ones that's not, they not. So tell a friend, tell a brother, cousin, mother, sister, whoever. Your spouse, somebody. See, that's it right there. He's got no worries whatsoever because he knows he can come. With the 14th pick in the 2010 NFL Draft, the Seattle Seahawks select Earl Thomas, defensive back, Texas. This is somebody that I wanted you guys to be here. Now, this kid, this kid is, is, is he kind of fast. And, you know, he, is, he built like, I guess you could call him tank-like, you know what I'm saying? 4-4, four, 5-10, four, he benched in a tw uh, 225, 21 times. But he seemed more like uh, one of these little small, fast DBs, almost like a, a Pac-Man Jones. -like hey, man, the, the, the best comment, Mike Mayock said it. This is the kind of cat you put back there. Most people be looking for coverage and trying to cheat over. He be like, motherfucker, bring it. I got him. Don't worry about it. So you think he's a he's a ball man? Watch physical it. corner. Physical. Okay, he physical reminds safety. me more of Pac-Man Jones. He's a safety with cover skills. He reminds me of Pac-Man Jones, not in Pac-Man Jones attitude, but just a kid. It's like, who that little boy fast? Look at you everything he did. He ain't falling down. He bringing it back. Well, no, I mean you know he's making plays. He's making plays all over the place. That right there was a hell of a break on the ball. You know to cut in front of that pass and not get pi. That was yeah, a nice pick. Nice. Yeah. That was a very nice pick. And come up for that run. Stay with it. And strip the ball. Stay with it. Way to stay with it. Way to stay with it. Man. So yeah. I mean, you know. Now who took him? Pete Carroll. Seattle. Seattle took him. Now I'm gonna tell you why that's a good pick. Seattle knows they gotta go up against uh, the kids over there, in Arizona. You got Crabtree over there at uh, uh, San Francisco, and uh, New Orleans. New Orleans throws the ball like crazy. Well, no, New so, Orleans is with uh, uh, New Orleans is with no, no. It's Seattle, Arizona, St. Louis, and um, New Orleans. No, man. it's not New Orleans. New, New Orleans, Orleans is the South. South. Okay. Uh, NFC South. And uh, Frisco. Those four. Frisco, right. Frisco. Uh, St. Louis, Seattle, and uh, the Rams. Okay. Well, St. Louis. Well, I guess. Well, I guess that's a pick. Just you put that out there right. for, for the Cardinals and all the throwing they're going to do. But honestly, when you look at that now, Matt Leinan is the quarterback. Yeah. You really don't need this kid then. Man, Lionel ain't going to do what uh, Kurt Warner did throwing that ball. But knowing how Pete Carroll is and knowing the talent. See, what, what people got to understand, his two picks, the reason he took Williams, I played against Williams when Williams was young and started for three years when we played him in a championship game like, three years back. He remembers that. The reason I took Earl Thomas is because I remember playing them in a championship game. Right, this ain't college. He better check But he, he, he understands his talent that he's getting. He's playing. 